Hey guys! I'm really feeling the holiday spirit with my new Christmas sweater from Zazzle. And guess what? I designed it myself. I put little pixel flowers and hearts and reindeer and trees. What do you guys think of this pixel art design? The sweatshirt's a size small. It's super comfy and really warm. Um, and I cut off the neckline to get this kind of comfy off the shoulder look. And then I added this Christmas tree cut out in the back for just a little cute accent. For me, I always find it really hard to think of the perfect Christmas present for all my friends and family. So this year I'm thinking about doing personalized gifts. And Zazzle's a great website that allows you to create your own design and print on so many cool objects. I knew you could print on clothes, but I had no idea you could customize your own lamps or pillows or necklaces and watches. If you guys could create any design and print on anything as a present for someone, what would you guys do? So to get the off-the-shoulder look that I have, you're going to want to cut the neckline a little bit wider, half an inch off of each side, but don't go any deeper. And you're going to want to cut the front and the back of the neckline separately so that the back isn't too deep. So here's what the sweatshirt looks like with the collar cut off, half an inch off each side. So if it's sitting in the middle, it looks like this, or you can wear it off to the side like this. So even though I've customized the sweatshirt with my own design on the front, I still want to add something special to the back. And my idea was to do a little Christmas tree cutout right on the shoulder blade on the back here. So when I'm wearing it off the shoulder on this side, there'll be something on the back here. So I've made a little illustration to help you guys with guiding the shape and the size of the Christmas tree cutout. I've made a little illustration file which is available for download. Link is in the description box below. And when you open it up, you'll find something like this which you'll need to print out. And you're going to need to cut out every little shape. And that's going to be your tracing guide. So you'll want to use this to kind of guide where do you want to put on the shirt. And I'm going to put it right here. I'm going to be using fabric chalk which is like a white crayon. And I'm going to be tracing out all the shapes. And then that will help me just cut everything out. Okay, so once you've printed out the template, just using regular printer paper, and hopefully you have a printer at home that you can use, you're going to want to fold the Christmas tree in half because this makes cutting it easier. And then you just trace each shape and snip it out just like I'm doing right here. So here we have our Christmas tree cut out. And you're going to use this to figure out where you want to place it. And using our white chalk, we're going to mark it down. I'm using fabric chalk, which is also referred to as tailor's chalk, and it's great because it's designed to draw on fabric, and it's only temporary. It leaves this kind of waxy finish so that once you're done the shirt and you wash it, it'll wash away any leftover marks. If you don't have this at home, you could try regular chalkboard chalk, the kind you find at school. I haven't tried this myself, but I read online that it's a good alternative, and it's easily available. So if you have any experience with using chalk to draw on fabric, please let people know in the comments below because I don't personally have any experience with it. If you guys want to cut up this exact same sweatshirt, I've uploaded the design to Zazzle so you guys can purchase it and do it exactly the same way I did. My referral link is in the description box below. And Zazzle has given all my viewers a 10% off coupon code off of anything on their website. The code is Selena Zazzle, and it's good until December 15th, so you can take a look and see if there's any potential Christmas gifts. And don't forget to check out my blog for the write-up of this tutorial, the download link for the Christmas tree template, and for more photos of this sweatshirt. And plus, I've uploaded my first beauty product review, so check it out and let me know what you think as I start blogging more. And I'm going to upload a new video every single Tuesday, so subscribe for T-Shirt Tuesdays. And I want to do more Christmas videos, so let me know if you have any ideas for Christmassy cutout t-shirts like this one. Thanks for watching, you guys. Bye!